take it from a guy that gets drunk and just talks shit in the shed. That's what I'm doing. At least I have this. Thank you, audience, for listening. I appreciate that you're here with me. Because if I was out in the middle of nowhere with my shitty not getting late energy, yeah, I'd be trying to get a group together with guns to play, hey, let's do something about it. And then what happens is, you know, you get together every week and, like, you just pretend like you're going to do something. And then some FBI dude who's way cooler than you, you know, he's actually maybe done training or whatever the fuck he did with his life. He's way smarter. He got into the FBI. He's probably got a good body. And then he just starts showing up to the meetings. And he's like, hey, why don't we just go hijack the mayor? Why don't we go out there and let's, uh, let's, let's kill the governor? And everyone's at the meeting and they're looking over at this guy and they're like, yeah, 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 what he said, because they don't want, they're there to pretend like they give a shit, like they're going to do something. And you got this one loud mouth who's going, why don't we actually do something? I say we take over a city block. And everyone's like, fuck yeah. And then they get home and they call it, they're like, dude, we're not doing that. Right? Like, dude, we got to do something about the new guy. The new guy's taking it a little bit too far. And I don't know that that's actually what happened. But I do remember, and this is unresearched, so you can go look this up, uh, but I remember years ago, the FBI busted some terrorist groups in, uh, in uh, like, around the Bronx that was planning on blowing up synagogues, and then found out later, and I believe that the FBI recruited these people, gave them the idea, they took them around along for the ride, but they never would have originated it. I'm willing to best that this is exactly what happened here. The guy showed up, and, you know, either they were just, you know, being dumbasses, or he was actually the one that stood up up and said, hey, why don't we really do something here? And then everyone's like, yeah, and then they were never going to do it, and next thing they know, they're getting arrested. Uh, and also, this has to be the funnest gig in the FBI, is that you get to feel like you did the deep undercover work, and you busted some terrorists and realized you're just getting drunk and jerking off with dudes in their shed while they try and pretend like they were going to do something, because I assume that's how those people are running their militias. Don't get weird, Sid. Uh, here's how you prevent <laughs> the FBI from getting into your militia. I've got some suggestions. You're out there. You know, you're trying to you're trying to do what I do here. Hoot and holler.